All right, everybody. Welcome to my reaction to game four of the 1992 finals between the Chicago Bulls and the Portland Trailblazers, where the Bulls led the series two games to one. Did they win, leading the series three games to one, or did the Trailblazers tie the series at two apiece? Let's find out. MJ. Well, he, he felt the footsteps. And got his third team foul. Portland with one. Martin Williams. All right for Levingston. And it's recovered by Levingston. Jordan for three. Wow. Michael Jordan has gone back. First two rebounds of the team for Jerome Kersey. Yeah, the dribble is lost, but they got it back. That was a good layup. See, this is back when NBA players used to take their time with their shots. Now they be rushing the shit. And one. Oh, we blocked that. He's like, get that shit out of here. What you want to do? Mmm. Oh, Clyde Drexler stole that. Three. Yeah, he made that. I missed that. Out of bounds. Trailblazers ball. Here's a 
passive income off. Trailblazers beat the Bulls 93 to 88, and the series was tied at two apiece. player of the game was it's a tie between Jerome Kersey and Clyde Drexler they both had 21 points Jerome Kersey had 4 rebounds and 5 assists Clyde Drexler had 8 rebounds and 9 assists Let's see Michael Jordan had 32 points, 5 rebounds, 6 assists. Scottie Pimpin, 17 points, 9 rebounds, and 6 assists. But the player of the game belongs to Jerome Kiersey and Clyde Drexler because they both had 21 points. Hmm. My reaction to game 5 is coming on Sunday. And then my reaction to game six is coming on Sun is coming on Wednesday or Tuesday. That wraps up my reaction to game four of the nineteen ninety two finals between the Chicago Bulls and the Portland Trailblazers. I got one more NBA game to react to. Game two of the 2007 finals between the Cleveland Cavaliers and the San Antonio Spurs.